Hey guys, it's Ken from Kevity Productions TV. Guess where I'm going tomorrow? I'm going to finally go get my Nexus Pass. Uh, let me flip the camera. Double tap. All right, we're in. We've got 33 people already. Nice. So I just finally got, uh, I guess, uh, June 6th, I applied to get a Nexus Pass, which is a pass that allows me to get across the border into the States faster uh, because they do all the security checks now. Uh, and so they don't always have to do it. Kind of basically they're doing a security check on every time you go over the border. So uh, like when we went to VidCon, you know, I had to line up behind everybody else and then take off my shoes, my belt, all my stuff. And, and once you've done a security check through the, pr the process that I'm doing right now, then you can actually have this special card and you can just walk right past everybody up to the Nexus thing. They've already done the security check on you. They know where you live. They know all about you. And uh, so you just walk through and you don't have to get as much scanning stuff done as, uh... uh oh, the streaming's not working. Somebody says, come on stream. Hmm. Shockwave said that. How much uh, harm do you, how much, harm could a Canadian oh yeah that's right how much how much harm could I do that's right we throw poutine at people and it's it's very highly illegal in some countries uh so I have to drive it's funny that so you have to fill out all your stuff online first and then you have to uh, apply and then you have to wait for them to give you an appointment where they actually grill you like as if you're doing a border crossing so the, the closest place to my house is the Toronto National Inter International Toronto Airport or Pearson. And uh, so I'm just reading comments. Hey, Matt's in the house. Mustard. <laughs> yes, sir. Anyway, so you have to. Uh, uh, so they basically give me an email saying uh, we have an appointment for you. You can pick the one that's going to happen in September or we have two other appointments that you could go to. Both of them are in Buffalo, New York. So it's like two hour drive, but I can go tomorrow morning. Uh, so what's a Nexus card? I just explained it. Nexus card is uh, almost like a security check they've already done to you now so that you can go across the border back and forth for five years for 50 bucks for this card. So when you go uh, to the border, you have to line up on all the cars, wait for all the cars to go through. They ask you for your passport and all that stuff. When you have a Nexus card, you bypass all that stuff, go up to a special, it's like a, an express lane pass, basically, because they do all your uh, uh, your security checks now. So tomorrow morning, that's the that's I can't believe they sent me an email now saying, oh, you can come tomorrow morning uh, in Buffalo. So I had to get up early tomorrow morning, drive to Buffalo, get my Nexus pass. Actually, no, I have to do two meetings, I believe. I have to talk to the Canadian people, and then I have to talk to the American people, and then it's going to grill me as if I uh, is Dame in the house. I just saw the word Dame. Hey Dame, I'm just finishing up the uh, the video. Uh, it'll be up soon. I'll send you the link anytime soon. Uh, so Anthony's in the house, the Daily Brown. Oh, some people from New Zealand are in the house. Very nice. Anyway, so I just thought I'd tell you guys that I finally got, uh, I guess that's what, almost two months it took for them to reply back to me to give me um, an appointment to go to the airport. Uh, how many of you guys have a Nexus Pass? Uh, I think it's only between the United States and Canada that you can get a Nexus Pass. So if you, any of you guys are thinking about traveling back and forth, uh, James has a Nexus Pass, very nice. See, it took me a long time uh, to get my next or to get the uh, interview, I guess it's called. Oh, the heart counts are going good. Very nice. Thank you for all the hearts, guys. I think we're up to like, I don't know, 50 to 70,000 hearts. Try deep fried pickles. Yummy. I did. I have a video on there. Go check it out. Let me know what you think. It was at Harvey's. And somebody said, ew, deep fried pickles. Uh, so there you go. There you go. I just wanted to make sure you guys knew what was happening tomorrow. So be prepared for a travel vlog. I'll be going to Niagara Falls to the Buffalo side, get my uh, my interview done, and then I'll be coming back. Deep fried Oreos, nice. Where is GameCon? GameCon is in Galveston, Texas. So right on the very south part of Texas, right along the water, there's a long strip of, a long, very long, thin island, and that's called Galveston. And I'm speaking there with Dame. Dame and I are going to be doing a live, we're doing a whole bunch of meetups, and then we're also doing panels, 
and talking about production and a lot of stuff. We're not necessarily talking about gaming. We're there for production and uh, that kind of stuff. Um, and then Dame and I on Saturday, I believe at four or five, we're doing an actual live, I'm not sure if we're gonna stream it, but we're doing a live food review. And so everybody, I think there's like uh, two, two to three thousand people coming to the GameCon this year. I think it's going to be bigger than last year. I didn't go last year, but anyway. Uh, Corey Spears is in the house. Nice. It's kind of nice to see uh, you guys dropping by and saying hi. I'm going to move this a little bit closer so I can see. Connie and then Forbidden Food, Chris. Then we have uh, Bite Chew Review. And then we have James, Joe. All right. All right, guys. So uh, I just wanted to make sure you guys knew you're going to be having a little bit of a travel vlog tomorrow, which is going to be kind of fun. And uh, yeah, it's all right. Thanks for all the hearts, guys. Oh, shout me out, please. Who is that? That's Donald. And then we have Connie and Anthony and Joe. And oh, I already said their names already. Oh, look at everybody. This is Please, Ben said, please, Amy says hi, and uh, it's hard, guys, when the, when the questions start coming in, it goes, Phew. and then Jasmine, until next time, Jasmine, hi, Pamela, I guess Pam's in the house, all right, talk to you guys later, thanks for stopping by, thanks for all the hearts, see ya!